Welcome Aries to your March ASMR soft spoken tarot reading. So adjust your volume accordingly, get nice and comfy. We're going to begin your reading for the month of March with a crystal card and see what crystal will be useful to you in the month of March. We pull black tourmaline. It's a root chakra stone. This stone helps with protection. This is a stone that helps you to be grounded. It's very focused. It's going to keep you level-headed, really good for making decisions, um, staying motivated to stay on task and to finish projects. This is a good one to carry with you for protection um, psychically and also from your own negative thinking or perhaps negative thinking patterns. Any sense of self-sabotage and things like that that you may struggle with here and there, they're going to be a little bit easier if you work with some black tourmaline in the month of March. We're going to pull you a shadow self card, so we need to do some shadow work. And in the month of March, Aries, 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 your shadow work is going to be working on feeling good enough, embracing the fact that you are amazing, you are loved, you are special. You are one of a kind, and no one in the universe can be just like you. You have a special gift, especially, that's going to be shared by the end of March. I just feel like, Aries, you have something really, really special to share with the world. It's something you're doing that's part of your life path and life journey. But in order to start taking steps towards doing this wonderful wonderful thing that I feel like it's going to be like helping other people, you need to first stop and help yourself. Sometimes you tend to put others ahead of you. You get a little bit drained. Um, it's very hard being very empathetic and kind because it is draining and you're tired and you're stressed and you come home and you flop into the bed and you just want to give up at the end of the day sometimes. But in the month of March, when you're feeling like that and when you're having days like that, I want you to carve out some time for self-care. Grab your favorite book your favorite pillow, blanket, your favorite food or snack, something like warm that's going to fill your belly and be warm going down, really comfort foods, maybe a nostalgic movie. We want to give ourselves lots and lots of self-love and care in the month of March. I feel like there's just a little bit of sadness, but not too much. There might be certain pain points or triggers this month, so be very careful. And just notice that if you feel yourself beginning to be triggered by something, you can always say, I recognize my trigger, and now I'm going to go and distract my mind from it. And at that point, you can do whatever you want to do, whether that's grabbing a crystal, meditating, ritual work, praying, anything. So you can definitely dive into your shadow work in the month of March without fear. Don't be anxious or afraid to dive in because sometimes diving into the nitty gritty yicky gicky stuff, that's what's going to be the most healing at the end of the day for you. Now we're going to give you a general reading with a tarot card here as well. So we're going to see what tarot card pops up for you as the general card for the month of March. Uh, you got temperance. Now this is about having patience. This is also about balance. As we can see here, this is about um, two cups. One has a flame coming from it. One has, you know, water pouring out of it. So you want to be careful, again, not to be giving too much, extending yourself too much, making promises you can't keep. One problem you may have is learning to say no to people this month. But Aries, the universe is saying, honey, it's okay to say no this month. It's okay to tell someone you just can't do it. You don't have to always be there for everyone all the time. Sometimes you need to be there for yourself. So temperance is about learning to balance that. And when you do, the butterfly is going to emerge. You're going to come out as the butterfly. This metamorphosis, this process of spiritual growth, of feeling mentally stronger. You're going to have more clarity and more intuition that you're able to harness. Super easy. Like I feel like you're going to start really tapping into some psychic gifts this month so i'm super excited for you i hope you guys have enjoyed the reading and have a wonderful month if you did make sure to like down below and i'll see you in next month's 